Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I know I look really crazy. I didn't even comb out my hair this morning. I'm gonna film a like chit chat hair get ready with me because I was doing my makeup and I was like, I don't think I've ever seen anyone just do their hair and like talk to their subscribers. So why not do that? I mean, I wanna try out some new hair extensions that I got a couple of months ago and I haven't had the time to use it. So I just wanted to try it out today and just talk to you guys, chit chat a little bit. I know I did a chit chat already with me like a couple of days ago, but I don't know. The thing is, I feel like it's really boring for me to just sit here and explain to you guys how to get a sweet ponytail if I already did a video on it, you know? So I thought, this would be more interesting. So the hair that I got is from G Hair, and as you guys can see, it's pretty sleek and shiny. So I'm not too sure how I'm gonna make it work, but I'm gonna make it work. I was thinking about just doing like a ponytail. I think I want a ponytail. I'm not sure. I might just make it into a bun because I haven't done like a big bun in a long time. So I'm not sure yet what I'm doing, but it should be a fun video. So if you haven't subscribed already, subscribe to my channel, join the family, and let's start playing with some hair. So this hair is actually just one um, clip in, like one, one strand, one track, one track of clip-in extensions, and they're very, uh, it's very thick. And what I like is that they actually have two tracks, as you can see right here. So that way you have like a lot more hair than if you were to just put in one track. And the thing that you guys saw is actually a hanger that it came with. So you can just put the clip and track in here and then just hang it somewhere. Like if you're in the shower or something, you can just like hang it in the bathroom and just have your hair just like hanging there for the next day or something. I think that's really, really handy. So I'm gonna try to make this work. I don't really know how. I I know that my hair is my hair right now is actually blow dried I have some like gel in it that's why it looks really dirty um, so I'm just gonna figure out what I'm going to do I don't really know I'm gonna leave the specs of the hair right here so you guys can read exactly like what kind of hair this is and like what color and how long and everything um, I actually got this in black because I always get 1B and that just doesn't match my hair color I actually have black hair I didn't know I had like black black hair but I do <laughs> so because my hair is blow-dried I don't want to put too much product in it um, because then there's like no point in having blow dry hair because it's just gonna frizz up again. Um, I'm gonna start by taking some of my Cantu Shea Butter Leave In Conditioning Repair Cream. I use this every day actually. <laughs> but I'm gonna take the tiniest bit, like right here, this a little bit. And then I'm just going to put this like um, on my edges a little bit. It's like just here, not too far back. So it doesn't frizz up. I don't want my hair to be frizzy, you know? I'm gonna take a little bit of my Eco Professional Styling Gel. And I'm gonna take a little bit of this as well. I think I should put more cream. I don't know. How you guys just saw my hair, that is actually what my hair looked like all weekend <laughs> i am now in like my exam period i have like a bunch of exams for the next like two weeks so this is like my off time me filming a video that's like a study break <laughs> so i'm actually gonna just make a ponytail i think i want like a high bun the thing is i don't really know what i want <laughs> Ooh, okay, so that needed a lot of focus. Had to stay focused. Um, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm literally just weighing it. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, I'm gonna make a little bun out of it. Thing is, this is pretty long. As you guys can see, it's like really long. So I'm, take, I'm gonna take the middle one and I'm gonna put this 
in front right here. And <laughs> you know. I have no idea what to do. I'm just gonna do it around and put it around it. Okay, like that. And then I'm gonna make a bun. Thing is, I am the worst at messy buns. Like I I'm just not good at it at all. Maybe I should just do it like this. Or something like this. I don't like this. It's not cute. Cute. So as you guys can see, it doesn't match my hair texture, but if I put a lot of gel in, my hair is a lot sleeker, but because I want to make a big bun, or maybe I should get a sock. Should I get a sock and just make my life easier? I think I'm going to get a sock <laughs> because that's just so much easier. Give me one second. So I got these socks at uh, Primark. Just simple socks and I think I'm only gonna cut one pair I mean like I want it to be like a big bun I think as you guys can see like wait, let me show you if you don't have a lot of hair and you use this as like just a ponytail and you really put it like inside and then like I don't know how to explain it <laughs> but if you were to put this in your hair and then make a ponytail out of it and you have really short hair then this is how thick it looks just so you guys know you know but now it looks crazy. I haven't done a sock bun um, like hairstyle in forever. So hopefully this works because if it doesn't, then I cried up the sock for no reason. I'm gonna take this here and put it through the sock. The, the last time I did this was literally uh, like five years ago maybe four I so I used to do this like in the beginning of like my YouTube career it was probably like the most embarrassing video that I'm filming because I can't even put on a sock thing is I don't want it to be like a perfect one either I want it to be like messy You need a bunch of bobby pins for this because I, don't know, I feel like I have it, but I don't know if I have it, you know? Because <laughs> now it looks really big, but it looks like it's to the side. I don't like that. I don't want it to be to the side. I want it to be right front and center. I mean, it's cute or whatever, right? I mean, it looks messy. It looks like it makes sense a little bit. I like it. I'm obsessed. I love it. I haven't had a big bun like this in forever. Now, I need to do my edges because, I mean, it's cute, but I want some baby hairs. So, what I actually do for baby hairs is I use a toothbrush because that just works really good i mean you can also just buy a brush or just use like a brush like this but i don't know i just use a toothbrush it's just a lot easier now i have very stubborn edges they never want to lay down flat they never want to do what i tell them to do so because of that i'm actually using the got to be glued um gel i know this is really really strong if you don't want to put anything strong on your edges then just put on like eco styler but that just doesn't work for me they just curl up and then they start looking like little curls like right here so um so that's the reason why i use got to be glued uh i'm actually just gonna start i don't know i'm just gonna wing it let's put a little bit on my toothbrush like this it's very very dirty don't don't mind it at all <laughs> and then because i want to be a little bit further so you guys can actually see the hair i'm gonna take in there and put it here and then what I just start by doing is comb it back like this and then make sure that I don't have too much um, got to bleed on the toothbrush and then comb down my baby hairs I don't have a lot of baby hairs I have a few and I don't really like the 
lots and lots of baby hair look either so I just really work with the baby bear the baby bears <laughs> the baby hairs that I have you see that this is like literally what my baby hairs look like I know some people like to take like a little bit more of their just hair in the back I don't like to do that I just like for them to look very natural as if I didn't even gel them down that's how I like for them to look so you see how my hair is kind of frizzing up already and if I don't put any gel you don't even want to see my hair my hair looks crazy it's absolutely crazy so I'm gonna put some hoops I actually also have just studs but I don't feel like putting studs whenever I have like my hair in a bun or in a ponytail I feel like hoops are just so necessary I don't know why but I just feel like I have to put in hoops like that I actually really like it I like the way that this hair look turned out so that was it for this video I actually I don't know I just thought I wanted to I don't know I feel like uh, what am I trying to say? Like, what exactly are you trying to say, Naomi? What are you trying to say? I actually really like the way that this hair turned out. I didn't expect for it to look this great because it wasn't really going too well like in the beginning. But I feel like it turned out really nice. I absolutely love it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this little like chit chat, chill, just talking. Uh, it wasn't really chit chat. I was just doing my hair and talking to you guys and showing you what exactly I was doing to do my hair <laughs> I don't know it was kind of a tutorial it was kind of a chit chat get ready with me because I have to head out of the house to do some groceries get a couple of things so I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video subscribe down below if you want to see more of me and like this video because it helps me out so much thanks for watching and hopefully I will see you guys in my next video Mwah. bye Crushing it